Hello, in this tutorial, I'll show you how to add keyframes in ClipChamp. So the first step I would like you to take is to open your ClipChamp account. If you do not have one, then trust me, you can easily get one um, uh, using Google. So just go to Google and search ClipChamp.com to take you to the official website and just register and um, to create an account. So once you do that, you're going to um, be logged into your ClipChamp account. This is what mine looks like. Okay, but this is not the home page. It will take you to the home page and you see a tab that requires you to create your video. Just so when you hit the tab, it will take you to this page called, um, I'll call the studio room where you can um, edit your videos okay so i want to um add a keyframe to um this clip champ okay so um if you if if you check other video editing apps you know it's gonna be it's it's usually very easy for you to add keyframes that are animated like animated keyframes so you could just add but yeah on clip champ you you really do not have that customized feature all right so but you can um there's a way you can go about it all right so you can definitely manipulate manipulate the process to get your keyframe okay so if you want to add um a keyframe, keyframes are what you add either at the beginning or at the end of the video so i want to add my keyframe all right and the um make my, my my first frame all right my keyframe so i just go ahead and split so that's my keyframes like my introductory frame and i just need it to be um like awesome i just want i want to be awesome so here so in between my keyframe and other frame i i have to add um a transition okay so i'll just go ahead and you know to this left corner of your screen and just click transitions so uh let's do um a transition that's um, so, so here like beat version so uh, so I'm so this is beams. All right, just click on it and add transition. All right, so um, go to the um, beginning of my frame and and see if that transition worked. Okay, just click in the beams again. All right. So I just play. Okay. Right, so just just closely watch what I'm doing, and so just shift this a bit, and get this head thing. Go to the beginning of the video and play. All right. Okay, so. So, so in this keyframe, you can just do whatever thing you want to do. You can just add um, effects, okay? okay maybe I, 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 want, I want to add this effect or just increase the speed or decrease the speed. All right, so this is it. And the, I hope you notice the changes. All right, so, so that's pretty much it. So you can just um, animate, all right? You can animate your keyframe. You can make it to be whatever you want it to be, all right? Okay. So just that's, that's, that's pretty much it. So you select your keyframe and do whatever you want to do in this your your um keyframe to separate it all right so so let's go for that again 
this be the video. Aha, uh -huh, so that's it. So this has been like animated. Cover again in play. So I hope you saw the changes. So that's that's pretty much it. This is pretty much how you can add keyframes and you know you know just get a job done. Don't forget this is my transition, so see it is it's moved. So so you can just keep doing that, you know, just explore as many options as you want to make your keyframe stand out. So remember, you can add your keyframe to the beginning or to the end. So you can even add subtitles or you can add text. You can add a different music depending on whatever you want to do it. So just follow those options and you'll get right into it and you'll be able to create your keyframe. So I hope this video helped you search.